You know, a big question everyone has been asking recently is how we can prevent school shootings. Well, one Eastern Iowa school says positivity may be the answer, at least among the answers. Sixth graders at Clear Creek Amanda Middle School spreading positivity on post-it notes. That's right. KWW reporter Taylor Bailey talking with the teacher behind the project. Taylor's live right now for us in the studio. Ron, the students say the positive messages on the post-it notes may not stop a school shooting from happening, but what they do hope is by making everyone feel included and important, the risk goes down. You're cool, you're amazing, you're nice, you matter. A quick note could go a long way. If you're just helping everyone be happy and stuff, it could prevent a lot of things and it can make their day a great day. Clear Creek, Amanda's sixth grade class, talking about school shootings this week. I get a little bit scared, but I also got to remember that there's a little bit of a chance that it could happen, but not a big chance. And if you help people, it could prevent all of that. Well, it was kind of scary because I didn't know if it would happen here, but like I know that there's not a big, huge chance of it happening here, but there's like a small chance that it would, and if it happened, like we would have teachers to protect us. Raising the question. You know, how do we stop it before something happens? And they're always like, you know, maybe you sit with that kid at lunch who doesn't have anybody or you'd be kind. There are nearly 500 post-it notes here on the sixth grade lockers with messages ranging from you rock and don't ever change. Something that students are really happy to be a part of. I like to see everyone smile because like, I guess it makes me smile. Post-it notes with positivity may not be the solution, but students and teachers hope it helps. The kids have feel stop something before it happens. And I'm not saying a post-it note is going to necessarily stop something, but it does help people feel included, and I think that can have a big impact. And right now the post-it notes are only on the sixth grade lockers, but the school is hoping a ripple effect will occur and all students will get a positive note. Taylor Bailey, News 7, KWWL.